Hey guys, um, so today I wanna to talk about the two products that completely sold me when I started using them. And that is the Norwex Enviro Cloth and the Window Polishing Cloth, okay? I cleaned my windows front and back, this mirror behind me and the other mirror in my, in my dining room with no paper towels, uh, just using water. And I'm gonna show you how fast I can take butter off of this mirror behind me using these two microfibers. And then I'm gonna pair, compare it to the standard cleaning things we might be using um, to take off butter or to take off um, unwanted things on our surfaces. So, and I'm gonna be using paper towels to demonstrate that as well. So, um, so let's get started. What I'm gonna use is just butter, like I said, and as you can see, I've, I've got it divided. So I'm gonna use this side to do Norwex, the other side to just use our regular cleaning window products, okay? And I'm gonna show you how fast it's gonna come off. I know we don't usually have butter on our windows or mirrors. However, could you imagine trying to take butter off with Windex or whatever it is we use? It would take so long. You would have to continually wash it. And I don't even know if you really get the sheen of grease off as fast as you would with this. So I'm excited to show you guys. how fast it's gonna come off. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, I just got this wet with water from my kitchen tap, okay? It doesn't have to be hot or cold, it can be whatever temperature you like. And I'm just gonna fold it in half and then fold it in half again. Since we're mechanically picking up things and dirt and, and germs, we want the biggest, best surface area possible. So if I have this wrinkled up and clean it, it is gonna clean it, but not as efficiently as this. A nice flat surface. I want every advantage that I can get, okay? I'm gonna, I'm gonna start, so look at this. That's it. So if I just leave this mirror like this, it's gonna streak. Um, so that's where this guy comes in, the window polishing cloth. Anything you wanna polish, um, make sparkle or shine, this is what you use, okay? So, look at that, all done. Right, isn't that amazing? <laughs> this saves you so much time and so much money. You're not gonna have to buy those stinky caustic cleaners anymore to do everyday jobs like your windows and mirrors. You're not gonna have to worry about the lint. You're gonna be able to be confident when people come over. You're gonna have nice, clean windows that are gonna stay clean for a long time. So let me move my camera over here a little bit to show you my other smiley face I need to try and take off, okay? And I'm gonna use paper towels, right? Uh, some foaming glass spray that I used to always um, use because I thought it was heavy duty and it smelled like it was doing something. It actually tells you in the directions, you must have the doors and windows open. Do not inhale it. It's very dangerous, <laughs> those kind of things. So when I spray that, their overspray goes all over the floor. So I have a yellow lab who likes to sleep right here and he'll absorb that through his fur and skin. So that's another reason we don't wanna clean with chemicals if we don't have to, right? All right, here we go. Looks like it's taking it right off. But there's that sheen. Can you guys see that? I can kind of see it right here. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> I'm getting close to it. I don't know if you guys can see that sheen right over here. It's 
it's not very clean. So here's the wind, here's the um, Norwex side. Here's the foam spray side that I used. I'm gonna try with a second cleaner um, real quick. I'm gonna get a, a couple more paper towels. Okay. So you can already tell, I'm taking a long time to clean this, just this one side. And there's some lint here now and smells like chemicals in here. Um, so I'm, I'm gonna be able to save money on my paper towel usage. Uh, I won't have to introduce chemicals into my home just to clean a mirror. <laughs> and I'm using just water. If you think about it, some, some chemicals that you bring into your home, you can't use on every surface. You can use water on every surface, right? So what I'm gonna do is, show you, you can also clean your um, appliances with these two. You can, play, you can clean so many things. I just wanted to share with you. This is my stainless steel appliance, right? Fingerprints, you name it. You guys know how annoying it is and how fast this thing gets beat up with food and you know, sticky fingers, it happens, right? All right, the same, the same microfiber. I'm just gonna come over here and wipe it off. Look how fast that was, you guys. And then you just come behind and polish it off. It's that easy. Um, when I clean my stainless steel appliances, I'd have to have at least, I'd have to wipe it with a sponge first and I'd have to spray it with a special stainless steel cleaner and then I would have to wipe it down like two different times and that usually meant leaving lint behind with paper towels so using more paper towels so I just wanted to show you how amazing these two products are used together um, you can clean your bathrooms you can clean your countertops granite quartz porcelain, all kinds of wonderful things you can clean your house with, and you can clean it fast and efficiently, better than you ever could with paper towels or expensive, stinky um, chemicals. So thanks for watching today, you guys.